What's up, fellow shark bait? This is KJ48. Oh boy, starting off the Let's Play with Ryan. Ain't it great? All right, guys, we are back with Raft. There has been a lot of updates I've not gotten to, and there's been a huge update recently, actually it was today, um, called the final chapter. Now, I was thinking about just jabbering on about the update on, you know, the front, you know, page here. We're not going to do that, though. We're going to get started, and I'll talk about the update as we play. All right, so what is the name of the world going to be? Season 5. Why have I only done four seasons of this game? That just doesn't seem right. Um, friends can n not join, not, you know, not to be a dick, but got to make some Let's Plays here. Uh, we're going to do normal difficulty and create the world. I'm going to do a little bit of an extended or a little bit of a um, sped up beginning here. Um, you know, I want to like make the video for people who maybe don't know a lot about Raft. But at the same time, a lot of people know about Raft. And I think we're just kind of going over, you know, old territory for some people. <laughs> Basically, I'm just trying to make everybody happy. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to give you guys an idea what the beginning's about. But it's going to be pretty accelerated at the start. Now, the final chapter, okay? Here's what they got in the game right now. New destinations. Lord and puzzles new enemies including bears and lurkers and i don't know what lurkers are supposed to be but they look like giant rats to me um, new features and items the receiver the steering wheel engine fuel tanks and pipe systems pipe systems that sounds crazy man we're getting into, like factorio stuff here um and a bio refinery and biofuel i am so freaking excited guys if you want to see you know this if you want to see more raft make sure to you know like the videos and stuff watch the videos share the videos all that good stuff and um yeah i think i've used up about all of the commentary i can for this extremely long loading screen so i'll be right back all right so here we are on our two by two raft for you new people um raft is a game where you're floating along in the ocean and um debris will be coming past you and you need to use this little hook thing here uh to grab it right and then you just kind of build out your raft you have to worry about thirst and hunger um honestly i think thirst is going to be my first issue um and your hook does take damage so you have to keep that in mind as well and you just kind of throw the hook out there and you, you just grab this stuff right and you just start like grabbing materials all right um, like I said, the first thing I think we're going to be looking at is probably some kind of water container. Uh, eventually you can make like, um, you can make like, uh, nets that can, that can just like grab this stuff as you like float over it. And that's what we're going to be doing. Obviously that's going to be freaking sweet. This game is awesome. There's so much of this game I have not gotten to. And that's kind of makes me sad. So, all right. So the first thing we're going to be looking to build here is going to be right here. Um, a simple purifier. So we're going to need planks, leaves, and plastic. All right, so these right here are barrels, and they just give you a ton of stuff, right? Just a ton of stuff all at once. Uh, so we're getting there. We are getting there. Also, the shark will attack your raft. Uh, uh, nice. The shark will attack your raft at points, and you got to be careful with that. Uh, as a matter of fact, we should probably make a spear sooner rather than later. Actually, maybe should, that should be the first thing we make. The wooden spear. Mm, I don't know. I almost think it'd be better to just... I don't know. I'm going to hold off for that for now. I'd really like to get that purifier down there. And then once we get the purifier down, we got to start thinking about food. Uh, simple purifier. We still need some plastic. So yes, this game does have a day and night cycle. It is now the morning. I slept through the night. I actually would have come back a little bit earlier, but, you know, it's dark at night. So I figured I would just spend the time, you know, getting ready for the next part of the video. Just be gathering stuff like crazy here. Um, I have, I'll show you what I got right here. I've got a water purifier and the water purifier is right here. That's what it takes. I made a simple grill. That's what that takes, right? Um, now the way you do these is if you look at the bottom, you can place planks on it for the fire, right? Uh, as a matter of fact, I'll place a plank right there. And then you put the item in your hand, like right here. All right, here. Oh, oh hold on. There we go. <laughs> Can't let that go by. All right, so right here, I'm going to show you how I do this. Let's empty this out. Let's drink it. So you come over here. Oh, I also have to make a cup, an empty an empty cup for the water. So you look at the salt water, press E, come over here, press E, and then it'll start cooking it, right? It'll start boiling it, purifying it, whatever. All right, now if you want to put stuff on the fire, um, stuff that I got from uh, for the fire has been from those, um, those crates, those uh, barrels, right? And things like potatoes and raw beets, okay? So you pick that up and you just look right there and you put down the raw beet. And this guy has been a pain in my backside. There we go. Oh, he's, he's dead. No, he's not dead. No, he's not dead. Oh, careful. <laughs> Basically, eventually you'll be able to kill him. Um, and if you do, you want to harvest his meat because he gives you a lot of meat. All right, right here. Look, 45% health. I got my hammer out. Middle mouse button repairs it. 
All right, you might be wondering what's going on my screen right now. A lot of stuff is going on right now. Um, I am, I've got hydration issues. There we go. And didn't I just drink? Oh no, I've got food issues. There we go. So I got the potatoes right here. I did cook up three potatoes. So we're gonna go ahead and eat those now. There we go. Food issues are averted for the time being. All right, so let's go ahead and grab some of this stuff. I'm gonna grab that plastic. Don't worry, I've got another hook waiting. Make sure you make hooks before you need them. Because I think if you like run out of plastic, then you got, you're gonna have to jump in the water to get the plastic and you don't wanna have to do that. Uh, freaking wood, man. There we go. Grab that. How's my inventory doing? Inventory's doing okay. I also got some of these blueprints from those barrels. Got the blueprint for the receiver and the antenna. The antennae. <laughs> uh, all right. So right here is a is a research bench, right? It's going to be the next thing you're going to want to make after you've got food and, and thirst taken care of. Research table's right there. All right. And then you go into it. And the way you research stuff is you simply put it up here. Research. Right? Um, research. It's going to use one of the items to research. Oh, a rug. Very nice. Research the plastic. We'll research the metal. We'll research the stone. Oh, I got enough stone to make a um to make an anchor. Cool. Uh, research the wood. All right, then you can learn everything. I can learn a medium crop plot. I can learn a lantern. I can learn a chair, a table, um, a bucket, arrows, uh, paint mill, and the rug. Now, the one thing I really want to learn right here is let me see if I can find it. Yep, this right here. I want to learn that connection net. I'm gonna need some nails for that. Okay. Now the way you get nails is you can either craft them or you can uh, you can find like little wrecks. As a matter of fact, if you look right there on the left hand side of my screen, that's like a little wreck. You could find nails out there. Uh, but what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to come right here and I'm going to make a throwable anchor. All right, and then we're going to continue building onto the raft. Okay, looking good. All right, so now I'm looking for um, now what I really want is one of those um, rafts out there. They're like abandoned rafts or whatever. And uh, I want to get one of those. Or, or a um, an island would be pretty good too. And if I find one, I can stop at one. Although I'm not going to stop at just any island. It, it's got to look like a big island. Because stone is limited. Alright, so like I said, I haven't played this in a while. Um, you don't actually need to find the nails. Um, I can make nails. I totally forgot about that. So if you come right here in the resources thing, you can make nails. So we just put some nails in here. Like so. All right, put those up there, put them right there, research, and now we can make nets. Be beautiful. Uh, we can make nets, we can make uh, trophy boards, and scarecrows. All right, so let's see what we need for the nets. First of all, let's make sure we get some barrels. Nets are the most important thing. You really want to get those going ASAP. Oh, come on, give me that freaking barrel. Unbelievable. <laughs> it was just out of my reach. Go ahead and build out a few more of this. And let's go ahead and see what we need for... I probably need that wood now for the nets, but that's okay. Um, you don't really want to put down the nets until they're protected, either. Alright. Stabby, stabby. Now, see, he just dives down. Because it looks like he's dead, but he's not really. Alright, go ahead and repair. Okay. Oh, grab that. Never ends in this game. Never ends. Alright, the nets. The nets. Where are the nets? There they are. Collection net. All right. Just gonna make as much rope as we can. Make a bunch of nails. And there we go. I'm gonna make as many collection nets as we can. Now, I'm not gonna put down the collection nets because they're super expensive. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make sure they're protected before I put them down. And yeah, you can stab the shark off of them so you won't lose them. But the thing is, I'm not always like paying 100% attention or I'm doing something else and the nets are too expensive to be, uh, to be messing around with. Also, we, we hit an island earlier in between cuts, and it kind of made my thing go sideways. So we're going this way now, which kind of sucks. Um, but what are you going to do? All right, now do we, have, we do have enough to build some stuff. So why don't we... Uh, I'm going to... Against my better judgment, I am actually going to put a net in. And uh, I hate going freaking cockeyed like this. But it is what it is. And I like to space them apart for the time being. Uh... Now, nah, let's just put that right here. No, 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 no. I'm going to go with my first instinct. Put that right there. Now we want to protect these as, as much as possible. Um, so we could put one right here. One. Oh, you can't connect these to the nets? That's kind of weird. Huh. I could remove that though, right? Hopefully it doesn't destroy it. 
Nope, it just picked it up. Cool. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to leave the nets on the sides like this for now till I, you know, understand exactly how they work. Okay. All right. All right, time to gather some more resources, get some more nets, and protect our nets. And we are having major food issues. These beets and, and you know, uh, the beets and stuff and, and the, the, the potatoes and stuff, they're pretty good, but you got you to gotta stay on top of it for sure. All right, fill with fresh water, drink, and replace. All right, we got a lot of stuff coming in now, man. Look at this. Look at this. Barrels for days. Let's grab this one. And look, stuff's already getting caught in there. You just press the button to pick them up. Is the uh, no? Nah, I'm just gonna grab that. Will that barrel get caught in there? I'm kind of curious. There you go. That's what I'm talking about, man. That is what I am talking about. All right, we need to keep this food going. Uh, we need to grab that barrel if we can. What I'd like to do is make a paddle. Uh, if, if I can make a paddle, I could kind of paddle in directions. So like, if I really wanted that barrel, I could have like paddled in that direction. One thing I really wish they'd let you do in this game is use the paddle or some way to, like, straighten out your raft. So it can go in the direction you want it to go in. And there might very well be one. Like I said, I haven't, <laughs> I have not been keeping up with the uh, updates in this game. I, I played a little while ago in multiplayer, but we didn't really get far. And uh, I'm looking forward to a long Let's Play of this game. I hope you guys are enjoying it because I really want to do more. There we go. Keep putting one in there. Let's go ahead and drink that. All right, so our thirst is doing really well. We won't have to worry about thirst for a good bit of time now. And I don't think I want to... So what, what's my next move here? You know what? Nah, that, that plastic hook's still looking pretty good. I think it's just all about... <laughs> I think it's all about the... um, All about the nets at this point, honestly. And keep a lookout for an island. There we go. Beautiful. Be beautiful. Oh, we need a storage item to... Uh, we need a lot of freaking... We need a lot of plastic, man. For reals. Thank God there's a lot of plastic in the ocean. Wait, is that a good thing? Well, not in real life, but in this game it is. There we go. Grab this bad boy. There we go. All right, can we make some more nets? Oh, God, nets don't take plastic. Thank God. There we go. Two and three. See, I, I, I didn't get there in time, or I didn't get there as early as I wanted to anyway. Alright, so let's go ahead and put two more nets down. Uh, I'm just going to put them right here, I guess. And then one right here. Uh, actually, I do like to leave, I like to leave spaces between the nets. Um, it's not, it doesn't really matter, honestly, but I don't know, it just makes me, I don't know, makes me feel better. I don't know why. All right, now we need to worry about protecting the nets. I think the number one thing we want to do now is protect the nets, and that's that's we just build stuff around them. Um, Freaking plastic, right? <laughs> we need so much plastic. All right, let's go ahead and do this and put some more wood in there. We're not going to worry about the uh, the other one for now. We're not going to worry about the uh, thirst for the time being because we're okay with thirst, and I really don't want to use the wood on it. What I'd like to do is just protect these nets. Is this going to be the corner? I can always break those out later. Will he come in? I see I can't connect it right there. Hmm. Maybe I shouldn't protect the nets. Maybe I should just pay attention to the shark chewing on the nets. Might be a good idea. Because the thing is, like, if I build, like, stuff in here, I'm going to have to break it out later anyway. Which is kind of annoying. <sighs> Still. Still. It's, it's worth it. Yeah, whatever. You know what? Resources are a big problem now, but they're not going to be later later in the game. So we'll spend the resources now, and if we have to break it out later, who cares? Because resources will be easier to get when we have like 50 nets set up. All right, guys. These nets have been doing work all freaking night. It's been awesome. Um, I went ahead and made a paddle. That's what it takes to make a paddle. It was a lot of plastic, but I think it's going to be well worth it. It's going to allow me to angle towards that island. We're going to land on that island. I don't know if it's a good idea to land on the island because a lot of times you can't get up to the like high parts of the island without like a lot of resources. So it might be a waste of time, but I mean, we're going to give it a shot anyway. Now, right here, you can see I have an anchor. You don't want to place this anchor until the last moment or until you're at least getting ready to go on an island because um, it can only be put on the outside of the raft and the uh, shark could bite that part off and destroy your anchor. So I wait until, the, you know, the last minute. Um, probably not really needed, especially if you're paying attention to the shark, but, you know, you know me. All right. Just going to kind of angle towards the sound a little bit with our paddle. All right, grab some of that stuff. 
Alright, that's looking pretty good. What, what angle are we going on? Yeah, that should take us right by it. I kind of want to get on the uh, the lower part of the island. Or Oh, oh, right there. You see right in front of me to the right a little bit? That's the area of the island I want to get onto. Now, this paddle is extremely uh, expensive in plastic, and it breaks down pretty quickly. So, I'm going to not use it unless it's uh, something I really want, and this is something I really want. All right, so we're going to go ahead and put that right there. And kind of go this way. I'd like to not be in the water if possible. That would be wonderful. And, you know, we probably don't even need the anchor. You could probably just get stuck in, on the island, right? Maybe. Will the tide take us eventually off of this? Yeah, I saw you. Now would be a great time for you to die, by the way. Yeah, see? Am I stuck here, or is this going to pull me off the island? I think this will eventually pull me off the island. So I'm just going to go ahead and throw this down. And now, we definitely will not be going anywhere. And this island looks great. Also, I went ahead off camera and made a stone axe. So I can cut down some trees. And let's go ahead and do this. Now, we won't be moving at this point. So we don't want to be on the island too long. Because if you're not moving, you're not gathering resources. Um, but this is going. To, this should really be a, a good thing here. Because, I, I mean, can we, can we collect bamboo? If we can, that's new to me. No, it's just for show, I guess. Uh, pick up yellow flowers. That's only for paint. Oh, I can't. Wait, that, was that hitting it? Doesn't sound like it. Alright. Let's get up here. I guess they give you ways to get up. Now this I know I'm going to get stuff from. Hell yeah. Not only am I going to get planks and palm leaves, but I might also get um, coconuts and stuff, which would just be wonderful. Uh, yeah, no coconuts. That's a bummer, but... See, back in the day, they didn't have these things up here. You had to, like, build up from your raft to get on these islands. Oh, here we go. Watermelons. I also got watermelon seeds from that, so that's great. Um, again, the flowers, as far as I know, are only for paint. So we will leave those behind. Now, uh, where do I go from here? Up here? Oh, boy. Come on. There we go. I'm king of the world! All right, cool. It's weird, it feels a little bit choppy up here, like, frame rate wise but I'm not getting any, like, like, any hits in my FPS, so I'm not really sure. We got a lot of seeds, too, so we can start planting that stuff, if we so choose. Alright. I'm mainly here for wood, to be honest, but... I wouldn't say no to some food. Let's go ahead and eat some of that watermelon, too. Look at that. Look at that, two eating, eating things per watermelon. Two chomps. Two meals. Yeah, there you go. All right, there we go. We got some coconuts. All right, so our space is starting to become pretty limited, and we will deal with that in a moment. Let's just look around, see if there's anything else up here. Uh, doesn't look like it. At least no trees. Trees are really what I'm looking for, because I want that wood. Man, look at that wood. 28, 28 wood. It's good. <laughs> and it rhymes. What's with, me, what's with me and rhyming today? All righty. Alright, so let's go back the way we came, make sure we didn't miss anything. I probably did, but whatevs. It's all good. It's all good in the hood. Alright. Oh, okay, so that's all water stuff. I'm just doing everything on the island first, then we'll go into the water. The problem going into the water is old Sharky is going to be a problem. Uh, I did I did make a chest off camera as well. See right there? Small chest. And we're just going to put that right there. And I'm just going to put some crap in there I don't care about. Or not that I don't care about stuff, I'm just not going to be using right now. There we go, put the nails, that, and one stack of wood. No, no, put the potatoes in there. There we go. Alright, so, what do we got below us? See, this is going to be a problem with the shark. Um, we could make shark bait, but I, I, need, I need a fishing pole. Actually, what the hell, I should have made a fishing pole. Do you have to research the fishing pole? No, you don't. Alright, well, we'll craft that now, but we're not going to use it right now. I'm just going to, you know, have it for later. Let's kind of look in here. And see what we got going on. Alright, so here we go. Got some metal here. This stuff is also going to be really important to get. Alright, there we go. Oh, you know what we need? We need... Oh, here comes the shark. So I've got a way to defeat the shark. At least I did back in the day. I don't know if it's going to work anymore. Uh, and, you know, well, let's just test it out. All right. So if the shark comes at you, what you want to do is you wait until he's coming at you. As soon as he opens his mouth, you back up and stab. And I waited too long. You back up and stab. Back up and stab. 
Alright, let's try that again. Coming around, Sharky. Okay, see, I got him. And if you do it right, he can't hurt you. I almost think I want to kill him. He's got to be low on health, because I've been stabbing him a lot as he's been attacking my raft, so... And if you kind of follow me, you can get a couple more stabs in there sometimes. Let's try that one more time. Come on, buddy. Stab, stab. Where you going, buddy? I gotta make a better spear is what I need to do. I don't have the materials for it, and I need to research it first. Come on. Die, bro. He's gotta be close. He's killing my spear, though. There he goes. Hold to pick up. Pick up what? Pick up the shark or something behind him? Oh, I'm getting the meat from him by doing that. Oh, okay. You used to have to stab him to get the meat. Cool. And that shark meat is going to be incredibly good. Oh, we also got a shark head. So that's for Okay, so while he's gone, why don't we continue looking around? He will come back eventually, but I will have a little bit of uninterrupted time here to look around, which is what I really wanted. Can we make another one of these right now? Damn it. Alright, whatever. Uh, no, not whatever. We need to make sure we have enough uh, rope for this before we do anything else. And I don't think I do. Son of a biscuit. <sighs> that means we can't use it to take other stuff apart. Damn it! I can't believe I don't have enough rope. That's crazy. Alright, well we can't use this. We need to use it to get rope. So... Oh, that's a bummer. So we kind of killed the shark for nothing. Well, we didn't kill him for nothing. Oh, look at this! Look at this! By the way, this is the stuff we want to get. We want to get sand, and we want to get stone. But like I said, we can't use our hook for... Well, we probably could. Yeah, you know what? The thing is... Okay, here's the thing, guys. If we break the hook getting that stuff, then we can't use it to get the rope to make another hook. Oh, that's the fishing rod. Oh, there we go. Cool. I was going to say, that's a lot of rope to make a freaking hook. Thank God. Thank God. All right, so what we want here is sand and stone, first and foremost. So we're going to... Yeah, so I was like... I don't... Why would it take so much rope to make the hook? That doesn't seem right, you know? And it wasn't. Alright, so... Sand... That's iron, I think. I do want... Well, it's metal. I do want iron, but I don't want it right now. Let's see what we need for the bricks. We gotta make a, um... A furnace. In order to make a furnace, we need to make these, um... These wet bricks. In order to make wet bricks, we need sand and clay. So that's what we're looking for. Sand and clay. And I think this is clay right here. It's either clay or it's stone. I think that's clay. Yep, clay. Alright, cool. Let's get some of this. We won't be making this this video, but that's something we're going to be looking for next video. Faux show. Look at that, man. That's cool. Alright, stay focused. I want to go underneath there and explore, but I really need to stay focused. Like, you know, for reals. <laughs> let's, let's not uh, go off the beaten path here. We need a lot of clay and a lot of sand, and we don't have the shark in our face right now, so now's the perfect time to do this. Now, we can get bit by the shark, like, maybe twice more without dying. So, if he get, if he comes back and gets me, um, I gotta leave, basically. Um, I mean, I could just stay there and try and kill him again, but... I don't know. That, that's really time-consuming, and it also takes a lot of wood because your spear kind of sucks. I tend not to do it too much um, until I can make better spears. Alrighty, more clay. No, that's not clay. That's copper. Yep. Oh, thing broke. All right, old sharky douchebag came back, so we're going to pull up anchor. Uh, it kind of sucks to you destroy the anchor. <laughs> um, I'm kind of wondering what happens on this island, but I don't want to I don't want to waste time here. Let's just let's just get going. I will get myself off of this island. Maybe. Come on. Oh, this thing's getting turned around big time. The nets work both ways. So, like it doesn't matter which way your raft is is turned, you know. Uh, the nets will work. So, it's just, again, one thing I really want more than anything in this game is the ability to um, to reorientate our raft. I hope there's a way to do it. There might be, you know, I don't know. But there wasn't one I used to play. But like I said, I have not played the most recent updates a lot. So there we go. All right. So I would say that was pretty successful. Let's go ahead and eat the rest of this watermelon. And then we need to get some major, major food intake. Well, you know what? The shark... It me is going to be the intake we need. All right, guys. You know what? I think we got a lot done today. Um, next episode, not really going to be doing next. Not really sure we're going to be doing next episode. I'd like to work towards the furnace, and like I said, the furnace is going to take the bricks. There we go. 
You make the bricks and you place the bricks. Now that brick will take um, a little while, like a few hours to dry. And once it dries, I will put it into the into the research table and then that will allow me to make the furnace. Yep, see, that's the only thing I'm missing is the brick for that. But that's going to have to wait for next episode. Guys, if you want to see more of this game, if you're excited about this Let's Play, please, 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 uncage the like button, share it with your friends, you know, watch the videos, comment, let me know how awesome this game is, because I think this game is freaking phenomenal. Anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time, and until then, take it easy.